This sign represents carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide has been and still is an essential molecule for life on Earth. There is actually very little of this molecule in the Earth's atmosphere. Only about 0,038%. However, this small amount plays a huge role in the greenhouse effect. Carbon dioxide is released when coal, natural gas or oil is being burned. Greenhouse effect is a natural phenomenon which traps solar heat in the Earth's atmosphere and keeps the temperature warm enough for life on Earth. Without it, the Earth's temperature would be 18 degrees below zero. But today, the greenhouse gases that protect us from extreme cold conditions now threaten human life by increasing warming conditions and other extreme weather phenomena. The reason behind this is because of industrial production, mass consumption and a modern way of life, which needs the use of fossil fuels being burnt that results in the release of huge amounts of carbon dioxide into the Earth's atmosphere causing global warming. Tokyo faces two major environmental issues, such as air pollution and the heat island effect in urban areas. In the stabilization wedges, I will find ways to reduce Tokyo's carbon emissions using modern technology. The nuclear energy wedge is out of context for Japan after the Fukushima disaster in 2011. With Tokyo's population increasing, there is a growing number of vehicles on the road. This brings me to the first sustainable wedge, efficient transport, doubling the efficiency of all world vehicles from 30 miles per gallon to 60 miles per gallon. Or people could even start carpooling to work or school. Second wedge I will be implementing is reducing miles traveled by passenger vehicles. This could be reduced by people using more public transport. The government must make transport cheaper and reliable for citizens. Third wedge, increasing electricity efficiency by changing the standard light bulb to the economically efficient LED light bulb, thus saving money and electricity. Of electricity from coal power stations with natural gas. The fifth widget I will be introducing is solar electricity. Equip houses and other buildings with solar panels or large areas of land. This widget is biofuels. Biofuels is produced from vegetable oils. And then the eighth widget is wind electricity. Placing wind windmills along the coast. Good thing about it, it produces energy from a natural phenomenon. However, it is also very expensive.